So I went to Michael's today for the first time in a while and I got these three items. There was a 20% off regular price item um, and then Valentine's was 40% off. Then if you're like teacher or military, you also get like 15% off. So all this together cost me like, I wanna say 13, maybe $14 with tax. Um, so I have an idea and let's see how it pans out. Okay, so I have chosen my mixer pairs that I'm going to be making. So we have peach nectar and hibiscus pineapple. We have bonfire beach and clothesline. Johnny apple seed and pink coconut. Sugared strawberry, coconut lemongrass. Black raspberry vanilla and blueberry cheesecake. Luna and aloe water and cucumber. And last but not least, Johnny apple seed and vanilla bean buttercream. Let's see how these turn out. All right, so we have Johnny apple seed, good and melted. So let's pour them in the mold. This is my first time doing it, so I don't know how many bars it's gonna take. I'm filling these ones halfway because they're mixers, so the other half will be the second bar. Just gonna need a little bit more for that third one. So I'm gonna get a little bit more for that third one and then I'm gonna let this set and we'll come back with the second set. So I have my uh, wax just chilling in the refrigerator and it is about ready so let's take it out okay so now i have melted vanilla bean buttercream which is gonna go on three of these hearts for the second half now these were chilling in my refrigerator like i just showed you i pulled them out um they're a little soft but they're solid enough to be uh, have more poured on top of it so it will not completely melt it and they'll stay separate so let's for the second half. Now, um, right before I do that, three uh, hearts basically was one bar, as you see here. So, so I've used about two bars for all of six of these hearts, but I'm only doing three vanilla ones. So I'm gonna make sure I divide it well. So we got our Johnny Appleseed and our Vanilla Bean Buttercream as the first three hearts. And now I'm going to melt some pink coconut for the second half of three, these three hearts. So I'll be right back. All right, so I have pink coconut all good and melted. And let me tell you right now, this scent is absolutely amazing. One of my newest favorite scents. So let's divide that between these three hearts. And there we go. So I am going to go put this in the fridge for a good 10 minutes or more until it is come almost completely solid just enough so I can get it out of the mold. See you in a bit. All right, so I'm back and these hearts have solidified. I actually went and stuck it in the freezer because I got too impatient with the refrigerator. So let's pop them out and see how they look. Look how fun that is. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. Look at that. So again, this is, oh my gosh, it smells good. Uh, Johnny apple seed and pink coconut. Look how cute that is. Let's pull out one of these ones. Johnny apple seed and 
vanilla bean buttercream. This one got a little bit more Johnny, which is fine. Super cute. I'm loving how these came out. So I am going to pop the rest of these out and then I am going to soft them just ever so slightly in the microwave and then I'll be right back so we can stick the stick in. All right, no time to waste. These have been softened in the microwave. I got these sticks. They are straight from, they don't always say the size. Oh wait, maybe it does. Here's the size right there, six inches. Let's attempt to put this in. Now again, this is the first time I'm doing this. So let's see if my theory worked in being able to stick the stick in. Ooh, there it goes. Ta-da. All right, so I'm gonna set that down. If you're wondering how long I put it in for, I put them in for um, 50 seconds, but I did like, um, five to 10 seconds at a time. So not all microwaves are created equal. So be sure to not over melt it. And there you go. We got two on a stick. I am gonna do the rest of these and then I'm gonna do the rest of the different scents and I will come back when I'm ready to package them all up. All right, now it's time to assemble these deluxe wax samples, mixer samples, I should say. Um, I have a little tag right here that I wrote the scents on. Um, I used a little bag and I put a little sticker right there. Now I made these stickers in Canva and then uploaded it to Avery. Um, this is a one and three quarters inch uh, round circle sticker. Um, so super easy, just used a, uh, I think I typed in Valentine's Day templates for the sticker section in it and it brought up these gnomes and I just added my website and the logo. So we are gonna assemble one, show you how I did it. So I am just using dollar store bags here. Now I know the dollar store makes shorter ones, but I'm just using what I have. So I'm cutting it to size, but again, they do make smaller ones. I just didn't have any, figured why not just use what I got. All right, now that that's cut, we are going to grab, let's see what one do I want? This one. So this is a cutie pie one. Get in there. And now these are just the twisty ties that come with the bags. Put it right here. And then also make sure, um, I well, I'm making sure that the lettering that's on these bags go towards the back just because I don't want them in the front. Just simple twisty tie. Now I just use a little bit of tape to um, put the corners down. store ribbon here. Now these tags came with um, little strings to uh, tie them with. I already pre-tied it for this. I don't want it long because I want it to stay pretty close to the top. Alright, 
So there we have that. And now we just need the sticker on the back. Ta-da! So I'm going to finish the rest of these. Um, I hope this helps. I'll take a few pictures, stage them for you so you can get a better look. But this was super fun and I hope my customers like them. Thanks for watching. Bye now.